I'm biggest. Uh, oh, what a beautiful day. The sun is shining, and I have got a very important mission. But as always, guys, the first thing to do is start our day off with a brand new nutritious breakfast. But before we do that, I have some pretty bad smelling breath. So as always, guys, first, I gotta brush my teeth. Now, I gotta take a shower, because I'm stinky. And finally, I need to... Uh, wait a minute. What is that out there? Oh, jeez, all these girls are back again. Why do they keep coming to my house? You know what? There's one at the window there. Get out of here, you flipping randies. Get away from my house. Everybody get out of my house right now. All right, we'll call the police. Three, two, one. Right, that's it. I'm going to have to remove you by myself. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, look, they're going. Okay, they're all going. Oh, my goodness. Let me shut the door on these guys. I can't believe it. Oh, finally, they've all gone. Now I can get back to doing what I needed to do. Okay, so this is where my recording software decided to break. And so basically, I'm going to tell you what happened. I heard a noise in the shower, went in, and one of the girls was in there. Next, I headed into my bedroom and hiding in the cupboard, guess what? Another girl. And finally, there was a burger girl sitting in the corner of my kitchen. Get these girls out of my house! So then what I decided to do was create a secret underground base so that these girls couldn't find my room anymore, and then I would never have to worry about them intruding again. And that's where we are now. So guys, obviously it's night time, as you can see right now. And I was thinking, though I deleted my house, this is kind of good because it gives me a perfect place to start. So here's what I'm thinking. What I should basically do is to stop these guys coming in. It's not to build like a little prison, but instead to build a secret base. So the way I'm going to do this, guys, is pretty simple. We're going to jump into build mode, which I believe is down here. I'm pretty new to this. And then we're going to begin building our house. So what I was thinking was building an underground house. So the way this is going to work is simple. I'm going to build literally like that. As you can see, a basement. And then I'm going to build one block just at the back here as a way to get inside of it. And then what I'm going to do, guys, is pretty simple, and that is cover the top of this. Okay, so guys, what I've just done is built literally walls around the outside of my house so that I have a nice square room, though I might make a little bit of a difference right here. What I'm thinking is that I might put some stairs here. So to do that, guys, it's pretty simple. Just come to the basement selection, and again, just make that basement even bigger, though you're going to need to remove that door first. So what we're going to do, guys, is simply remove the bit that we had here, and now we're going to put a wall around the outside just like like we did and uh, it's gonna look pretty handsome if I do say so myself let me just get this last bit of wool in okay so what we're gonna want to do next guys is put ourselves some stairs in which again is pretty simple to do so you guys have the option of what you want to put in I'm thinking of keeping this incredibly simple and just sticking a nice ramp in there just like that and that is our way of getting into our house. Now, next, guys, what we want to do is stick down a rug over here. So come to the carpet selection and just grab one of these carpets. I think it's this one here. No, it's actually this one. I'm such a dum-dum. And, guys, literally just cover this up like this. One, two, and three. And do that on the other side as well, guys. Just like this. And now it looks a bit weird, I know, but we're going to change that to a grass texture in a minute, and it's going to look amazing. So, the next step is quite simple, guys. We're going to want to put a roof on our beautiful little house here. Just grab the flat roof and give this a left click. Come down and give it a click just like that, guys. And as you can see, I now have a roof on my flipping house. Just like that, guys. You see that beautiful roof that I have? That is my roof. So now, guys, we need to change our roof into some grass texture. Okay, so guys, now we need to equip this texture, which is this one right here, and simply put the color green on it. You need to find the exact color green, otherwise this is going to look pretty weird. Um, I think it's that one right there, and I think we also need to do the same thing for this as well. Literally just do the exact same thing that we're doing like that, and guys, as you can see, we now have an invisible roof. Now do the exact same thing for every single one of these rugs, guys. You just want to make them that green color. And also select the texture. We're going to want to make this as invisible as possible. And just do that with every single one of them until you have the right results. And just like that, now I know you can sort of see the outlines of the edges, but if it was nighttime, 
then uh, you probably couldn't see anything. I mean, if you were just walking past, you wouldn't see anything. Okay, so now we're back to daytime, guys. What we're going to do is build a little house on the front of this, just so that people think that my house is a little wooden shack on the top. Because if they think it's small, they're probably not going to want to be a part of it, right? Okay, I'm literally thinking like this. What I am going to do, guys, is put this fence around so it literally looks like this is my like garden or something because that way at least it's not like suspicious these guys are gonna think i just have a pretty cool garden right okay so the next step is to build myself a flipping mini house and guys this can't look good because otherwise everybody is going to want to come into this flipping house so we're gonna keep this nice and simple in fact incredibly simple i'm literally gonna use the worst stuff i possibly can and uh just to make sure that it looks bad okay there we go this house is actually starting to look kind of cute i mean it doesn't look amazing but it does look a little bit cute. I'm trying to get a nice little window up the top there. Okay, next up, guys. Again, I want to keep this incredibly simple. But I don't want it to look too basic. Because otherwise, people are not going to believe that this is my house. Okay, so now, guys, I want to choose the outside color of this. Because I don't want it to look too basic. So, uh, what should I pick? I'm thinking something kind of cool. But at the same time, nothing too much. Maybe something like that looks pretty cool. I think I should just do that for everything. Okay, so, guys, this is where I... I'm at so far as you can see I changed my mind on what I was doing around the back here but I'm a noob so I don't know how to destroy this so I'm just gonna leave it around the back what I decided to do is have a garden and inside of the garden is gonna be a hole as you guys can just about see right here covered by a carpet which will be accessible by a ladder which will take us down into my secret base and now guys that we're inside I feel like it's time to actually decorate our base so otherwise this just looks kind of terrible so straight away I'm gonna choose the color of the walls I'm thinking like a nice color I'm gonna do like a feature color on this wall Probably like a vibrant blue, maybe not too blue, but something like a strong blue. There's got to be a nice blue in here somewhere. That one is pretty good. I think we're going to go with that. And then for these walls, I'm just literally going to paint these all white. Now for the floor, I think I'm just going to go for like a wood, just like upstairs. As I don't want it to be anything too much. I think that looks pretty good to me. Now let's begin to decorate. So obviously I need a big bed in here, though I'm thinking of just making this like a social hangout area. So what I'm going to do before I expand off of this base is keep it nice and simple so let's start with some chairs is it just chairs do we want a sofa we don't want a chair we literally want sofas are they here okay here we go we found a nice looking sofa right here guys i'm gonna stick that bad boy literally right here this is gonna be such a cool looking place to hang out everybody is gonna want to hang out inside of my house i'm also gonna have this little cushion i think over here it's quite small um you know what, I'll have it anyway, just in case somebody wants to sit on it. Though, wait, that's not the idea. I thought I was supposed to stop people coming in here. That was the idea of this flipping place in the first place. I do need some lighting in here, though, because it is pretty dark. So, uh, let's just get some, like, ceiling lights up or something. No, we don't want those. We want some ceiling lights. Wait, is that a love heart? What? That is kind of cool. Maybe we... All right, you know what? I'm going to put that there for a minute. Uh, but I might change it later on. Let's just get some lights on the ceiling. Can I put these up here like this? Or because it's a... Yes, I can. Okay. I'm going to put one here. And I'm going to put one over here. And also one in the middle. They're probably not symmetrical. But you know what? They light up the room just perfectly. Okay, so the next step is to get ourselves a pretty nice TV. I'm thinking something like that. Wait, is there one that's bigger? Is that one bigger or smaller? I think that one's smaller. We need one that's really big. Um, wait, how big is this? Oh, you know what? That is definitely the one... That is 100% the one. We're going to stick that right on the wall here for everybody to come around and watch. Actually, I don't want anybody to come around and watch. Why do I keep thinking I'm inviting people over? I'm such a dum-dum. Hmm, we want this plant, like, in the corner. That would be quite nice. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, so now that I have my living room, I kind of want to put a rug down, actually. So I'm just going to come to the carpet selection right here and find myself a nice big rug. Is that a big rug? That is a huge rug. That's probably a bit too big. How big is this one? This one is perfect. Okay, I'm just going to stick that like that, and I'm probably going to change the color of it real quick. Just to something a little bit less in your face. Because I don't want it to be too much. Okay. So now, guys, we're going to need a kitchen. We have a nice little seating area over there. But we need a kitchen because otherwise we can't eat any food. So what I'm going to do is come to the uh, decorate selection. Come over to some cabinets. And let's begin building with some cabinets. Is this what I'm looking for? I believe it is. Wait, guys. I'm officially out of money. So uh, this is going to have to do for a minute. I mean, it's not the best 
but it's mine, and that is what is important. And the best thing is, literally nobody knows about it. So guys, remember, literally all you have to do is access it from the back there, and you can get inside. Okay, so guys, my build is finished, and I come outside, and literally everybody is stinky, look. Stinky number one, stinky number two, look at her walking around all stinky. You need to take a shower. <gasps> oh, jeez. I don't have a shower. But guys, if I open this door, you will also see Stinky number three. Look, what is she doing inside of it? She's got fleas coming out of her and everything. Get out of my house, you stinker. But guys, like I said earlier, the plan was to create an ultimate secret base. And guys, let's be honest. If you turned up here, you would think, oh, this is just a really small house. I mean, it's kind of weird looking, but it has a nice garden, I guess. But <laughs> these guys are never going to find my secret base. Guys, let me show you my secret. Just down this hole in the corner, and you have got to be kidding me. How the flip did you guys get inside of my house again? What is going on, you flipping dum-dums? I got three stinky girls inside of my house again, and look, a beautiful mirror to check myself out in that pitch black. Can you believe it? They managed to find themselves back into my house. Oh, I guess sometimes you just have to do what you gotta do. But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please do hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? Alternatively, leave a comment or suggestion in the comment section down below. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye. <laughs>